hello 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 and welcome back to another reaction video this is your boy bob good morning good afternoon and good evening yes we are back with album preach and for those who have been following the album preach thing they were kind of like getting under the skin of fresh and fit so to the point that you know the allegations that was going on with um with fresh um having a baby rolling around so apparently there was like a little clip that was going on that if she was to sit up there and to um if she was to sit up didn't have a um have a child he was gonna name he was gonna name it after him so he can have something like basically just you know spiting him and Apparently she didn't keep the baby. I mean, that was obvious, but I'm not even gonna go into any more further detail. I'm pretty sure he's gonna go over it again in this video of theirs, updating about the whole situation. So without further ado, we're gonna get into it. Let's get it. There you go. Again! Today's update is kind of crazy. I never thought I'd be making this video, but you know what? If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Was I wrong? Not really. Kind of. Maybe. You be the judge. You idiot! Relax, bro. I'm going to do something that's going to make you look a little bit better. Picking coconuts in Barbados. Yeah. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought this whole Abba and Preach. Oh my Daisy God, bro. Can't wait here. The debacle, the whole arc was done. But another twist came down the way. Two twists. One okay. twist you guys already might know of. She didn't keep the baby. I'm not gonna kill my baby because I planned the baby with yeah. him. But it's just everything like after everything's going on, like really, like I just I, I don't I'm not gonna be a single mother. I don't want my baby grow up without a father. Even until now, he's not showing up. Not the biggest twist. I predicted this in the last video. Yeah, pretty I much. I said, listen, now me personally, this is how I think it's all going to end. I don't think she's a kid. I think everyone's going to be able to move on. And I think it's the best thing for everybody. They're, they're, they're not... I know I memed about having this kid named Adam Pierce. I think it's funny. But I don't actually want that to happen. I don't want some kid to be born in these circumstances. And if now, her not keeping the kid. Abba Chen. <laughs> hey, man, it's sad what they did to you. It said that you don't get to come into this world, but I ain't surprised. And Bro. considering the parental situation, your boy think might be for the best. I mean, you got a deadbeat dad who don't want to be involved and a mom who's kind of using you as leverage and some kind of, it's a bit of a weird situation. It no? is a weird Does situation. Does the baby make sense? Absolutely. But what does it also mean? It means that Daisy's lying, right? It does. She's talking yeah, about I'm does. religious and my religion, we don't kill. Nah, nah, nah. In my religion, we don't kill. Then you get rid of the baby. Something don't add up. There's enough of these little tidbits where I'm like, eh, eh, right? Yeah. Now, some of you are wondering, where's Preach? Hey, listen, Preach ain't always got to be here. Because Preach not ready for this energy. You dig what I'm saying? Because I hit up Preach and I was like, yo, you going to show up? He's like, I don't know. I'm like, bro, you need to come with that energy. What energy? And I was like, boys be <laughs> boys. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Maybe you just roll through and then I just grab your junk. Make sure that shit's still looking funk. You know what I'm saying? You know, you're boys being boys. You're comrade in arms. <laughs> I can't I wait. I come you. here so I can hold you in my arm. And he's like, nah, I'm staying home with my wife. I'm like, whatever, nigga. That's gay. Spending time with your girl. Gay. Don't want to hang out with the boys that cuddle up. Oh, my gay. God, yo. So Preach not here right now. But I'm here with you guys to give you the important updates. Because let's be honest, that's what y'all want. Okay? So Abba, Abba, were you wrong? Eh, kind of, eh, not really. Eh. I hedged just enough. But let's be honest. I made Daisy seem a little bit more credible than she actually was. And yeah. The truth is, yeah. She was yeah. lying about a lot of things. But the twist gets crazier. Okay, what's we'll that? Reaching out, talking with her, you know, get information initially when we were gonna do the first video. And see, the thing about it is, I haven't been following it since he did that last video, so this is actually a refresher from that, but it's also new information for me now. So. It probably for everybody else too, cause it it's been a little quiet right now, but it's not it's not far fetched from it being like fresh. It's still there. It's still lingering. Everybody asking questions and stuff like that. So we're gonna we're about to get a little bit of answers. Video. The weeks go by, 
she keep messaging me, but she messaging me weird stuff. Now I'm I'm not gonna get too many details. Weird what? Right? Um, generally speaking, when someone DMs me, I keep it private. However, yeah, if they tell me lies, Uh-oh. then I repeat them lies, or they start acting shifty. Which then hurts my credibility. Oh, Lord. Uh, you don't get what she done did now. You use our private correspondence to be a shifty person. You know it. I'll make you the fucking side of my that you really are, you fucking pussy. Myron, you realize that if you made me a sodomite, that would make you a sodomite. Down the Monko, Monko. Here's the thing that was weird to me. I can't yo, wait, yo, hell yeah. For real. With me. She's like, yo, I know you want me. And I'll look. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Let's 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 take a look at this. Let's 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 go with this. Okay, so apparently, what is it with everybody having screenshots with their phone by damn near dead? Like Jesus, come on, man. I don't know. It's like a pet peeve for me. I don't know, but apparently, this is a DM of um a Daisy Chin. Tomorrow soon. You know, no, I think you afraid of me. I guess that was, I guess that's him. I don't know. I don't know which one. Wait a minute. Okay, so this is him. This is him. And the green is him. I'm assuming the black is Daisy. That's why you don't want to talk to me, and I know, I know you want me. What the hell? Yeah, that's him down here, the green. Because down here under all of this, he's basically replying back to what she said about, no, I think you're afraid of me or whatever like that. He's like, LMFAO. You can't see it. It's LMFAO, afraid, question mark. He's like, no, ma'am. So... <laughs> Yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah, that's, mm. Huh? It's like, I know it. You want me. Now, please download Snapchat. Oh, my freaking God. This chick, yo, he just tried to help your ass. Like, hold up. Let me get my eye right. This is like some fucked up shit right now. Excuse my French. So, let's get this full front real quick. So, she basically wants to flip the script and just be like, oh, you know you want me. I know you like me. And all this other stuff. Jake, I just try to help you with your plead your case a little bit, even though you was lying your ass off. He was trying to trying to plead your case and now you want to sit up there and go dick riding on him? Excuse my French. Yo, this shit crazy, yo. He I look, Alba, do your thing. I'm gonna let you do your thing, Alba. Cause she being being crazy as shit right now. I'm like, nah, nah I don't want no more apps. She's like, please do it for me. And she thought that shit was gonna work. I was like, nah. It's like, so why are you talking to me then? And I was like, listen, you just had an abortion. I just made sure you were good. That's it. And, you know, she's trying exactly. to lay it on thick. And I'm like, listen, I'm, I'm like, lady, why are you being so aggressive? It's not like we out here sharing every detail about our lives. Like, why are you trying to say something? This is weird. Like, let me exactly. get this straight. You just date one YouTuber, okay? It goes horribly. You get pregnant by him after you accelerate the whole process insanely fast. Then you thinking about going through an abortion, which you do end up doing, and you lie about the timeline. And then yep. with the person that was helping you, helping to expose you. all these details, you trying to start some kind of illicit relationship, huh? Huh? Listen here, I like to cover days of our lives, but I ain't trying to be in it. My name ain't Walter. I ain't from Barbados. I don't like Damn. coconuts, and I ain't into tricking. That's not for me. I want my personal life to be free of abortions, free of drama, baby mamas, and everything in between. I'm not down for that. Now, I think it's really weird that you trying to get back into anything that's even remotely close. So why are you trying so hard? And here's the thing, let's be honest. Let's be honest. A woman that looks like that and takes pictures like that 
ain't laying on thick with a nigga that look like me. I ain't saying I don't get it in. I ain't saying girls don't check for me. But a girl that, that look like that, that take pictures like that, ain't making no advances on me. Unless it's for that shmoney. No, we don't have yep. to lie to ourselves. There you don't go. get me wrong. I do get my DMs. They don't look like that. Okay, and I ain't a dreamy type. I ain't no MLK. I ain't no sleep. No American dream. No nothing. I live in reality. I date real normal people. Maybe they come not once. This girl done did it like two, three times, and I said, "Oh, I'm like, there's no way you're that person. We don't have any reason." So of course I'm suspicious. She claimed that she'd kept the kid. Turns out she'd already had the abortion about two weeks before. So she'd been lying to everybody, right? Because she ended up getting yep. caught in a live stream drinking. And everyone's like, wait, aren't you pregnant? And then she's like, oh, no, I wasn't drinking alcohol. Then she had to walk her back and said, guys, I'm not keeping the kid. I just got the abortion. She'd already gotten it. Wow, that's why she she'd already it. gotten she'd it lying, beforehand. Folks, she was lying about that portion. The day she went to go get them ultrasounds and all that stuff, by that point, apparently she'd already gotten it done. That's right. Somebody apparently got in touch with her pimp. Yeah, 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 yo, this dude, he going in on her, like, he just, like, oh my god, like, he basically stand on business with exactly what he said, if you come to him with some shady stuff or whatever, which she did, he is standing on that 1000% right now, and like I said, when I first saw them DM DMs and everything, that we just showed earlier and everything everything that's going on right here do your thing man she was a really she really was a night worker yeah 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 but i ain't gonna give you the details on that that'll be true if logic is gonna do that and what's more she was going through walter's stuff some of his jewelry Ooh. boxes yeah 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 we got so she, was stealing him right here. Stealing, she was stealing his stuff too whoa like She's sitting out here thinking that, oh my God, fresh, come on, bro. You're lacking, bro. She in there stealing your stuff. Right, guys, go check out Tree of Logic because she's going to be dropping a vid with all the receipts and everything. But all this to say, what does all of this mean in the grand scheme of things? Walter, you're a sucker. You fell for that shit? Bro, I'm going to be honest with you. She hyper aggressive, but she ain't skilled. She don't got that finesse. I mean, one of the really good details she did is she paid for part of that bracelet 15K. You know, that's some next level tricking where you're trying to do the long con. That's yeah, really good. Yeah, but yeah. outside of that, her DM game was trash. The fact that you fell for that isn't because she's talented or she's some con artist. Is that you really wanted to believe that she was super into you. Because the way I seen her text me, I was like, Oh, girl, you you're, see, you're you, messy. You must be running game with 30 different dudes. I could see that from that DM that she he just pulled up. Like, with the demeanor that was going on with her. I already knew that she was going to be running game. I didn't even think she was going to run it so damn soon, to be honest. He tried to help you. Like, and then all of a sudden, you don't flip the script and just be like, yeah. We could be something and... You know, I know you want me in it. Yeah. And then on top of that, like he said, she was freaking aggressive. Like, he just tried to help you. Try to at least plead your case. How he just wants you from doing that. He just wanted that. He just wanted you to plead your case with your child. But you already had let aborted and you already did all that stuff. So. Yeah. Ain't no way. My girl got a football roster full of dudes. She probably texts them like this. Walter, Most likely. you're supposed to be an expert, but you fell for really lame game. And you nutted inside her and you got her pregnant. Now, we all grateful that she didn't keep yep. it because that baby would have deserved way better than y'all two as parents. How do we wrap all this up? The dudes in the red pill don't practice what they preach. Now, as for me. Nope. <sighs> I mean, let me be honest. We gave her a little bit more charitability than she probably deserved. But, hey, man, you know, it's all good. Because we didn't say she is one thing or another. The only people who said she wasn't an escort was who? Fresh and thin. But then she's running around and telling Abba and Preach and all these other simps, oh, I'm not an escort, and they're believing it. Oh, okay, I believe it. Letting her tell you all these lies. Well, question for you, bro. What proof do you have that she's an escort? 
This girl comes from a rich ass family. Yeah, bro. You know how d difficult it is to get a fucking visa as a Chinese national that was in the United States as often as she does? See, that right there, and see that see, this is not no made up stuff. I actually seen the clips for this. That was wild. That was wild and crazy. They set up there and say, Oh yeah. She she escort and all this other stuff and everything. Saying that they didn't know anything about her, and then all of a sudden you come up with information about her. Like, make it make sense, man. It's either she is or she not. Like, that was the stuff that that was the thing that was like blowing. That was like, okay, y'all slipping, y'all slipping, y'all slipping. Like, I'm trying to find some credibility for y'all. I mean, I love me some fresh and fit, but come on, man. Like, this this is these past times in this thing this all right here they've been taking ills countless of ills and i'm glad it's over and behind them but like i said you know a couple a couple other people agree with me too that i've been seeing some of the videos they be reacting to this and everything they all saying the same thing like like why in the world are you actually low-key defending this i i don't know but it had me mind boggled when he did that, when they made that move. She comes from a very wealthy family, bro. Here's where you're wrong. One, she's on the court. And two, I didn't buy a bracelet. Bro, you thought that shit was going to work on me? You don't know how I roll. Because we out here being <laughs> boys with the boys. She's out here holding each other's junk, walking down the street. Sometimes <laughs> your nigga got his knee all banged up from working out and shit. Oh, you need shit. a little bit of a support like a cane, but I'm like, bro, I got something better than a cane. It's hard too. She did. Yeah, yeah <laughs> that's not gay. That's not gay. That's, that's called not holding gay. up your homies, making sure they get to their destination. Everybody coming. You dig? Boys being boys. <laughs> hey, gay, bro, that's camaraderie. You wouldn't know nothing about that. You dorks out there playing video games and shit from home. Ain't never had a man hold you through the night and let you know how much you loved and shit, how much you deserve to be cared for. Huh? I How you deserve to yo. be seduced and shit? Drizzle, drizzle. Bro, I, I, my, my, my hey, only thing with the drizzle, came, drizzle. I, I, I had to help him clean, so I ate his ass. Just wipe it down. That ain't gay. That's that's called sanitation. That's cleaning. Pause. Unpause, because it ain't Big ass pause. Boys being boys. Hey, sometimes the homies come through and just fucking take me from behind. I'm like, yo, what are you doing? They're like, man, we on that fresh and fit. I'm like, oh, shit. Oh, hey, shit. <laughs> That's just boys being boys. You ain't never had a dude rub the inside of your thigh with some coconut oil, huh? Make sure that smooth and silky going down your leg. Make sure that little bit of dribble coming out your dick. Make sure that shit get cleaned up real good. <laughs> lick on lips. That shit ain't gay. That's just making sure your, your pipes are drained. I Call can't. me the plumber. That shit ain't gay. That's just boys being bold. That being said, uh, <sighs> conclude, I can't wait. I think that it can be said that Daisy, she's not an escort. She loves me for me. Okay? You wouldn't understand that because you don't have game. But me, I have game. That shorty over there, bro, she like me for me. Now, coconuts and Barbados. That being said, who decided two plus two is two? <laughs> no, no, let me stop. Anyways. Oh, okay, guys, that's it, man. I want to close out this chapter. No baby being bored. This girl's shifty. These dudes are frauds. At the end of the day, has anything really changed? No. No. Nope. The world is more of the same. I was trying to enjoy this Kendrick versus Drake beef. And then I had Ling Ling over here trying to do something nasty to me. You trying to give them ammunition for a future diss track, you crazy lady? I can't win him, yo. I, I, I really can't win him. Bro, he basically, he, I'm sorry. He basically cooked and flamed they asses at the end. I swear to you, he did. I mean, he took their logic, put it to the forefront, and that's basically what they was basically was on during that whole situation. Boys being boys and all that stuff. He just basically took it, flipped it, and just basically flamed the ass. And then added the damn drizzle drizzle into it. Like, oh my god, I'm done. I don't know. 
it got me thinking about rethinking about the whole fresh and fit thing now i don't know let me know what y'all think about it in the comment section because right now at this point i'm <laughs> abba 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 you've been doing it you've been you played your part in this one you're the one man show in this one i'm gonna give you that so without further ado i'm out this thing let me know what y'all feel man because we are kind of new the whole situation with you know with her was was going to go head south because he seemed like it was kind of sketchy anyway that part i did believe about fresh and fit you know she you know was faking and playing and everything like that and stuff but then when she had to come home brush up against my boy abba come on man like what you think he was gonna do he won't gonna sit up there and take that lightly he gonna flame your ass too you know but he flamed fresh and fit a little bit more though i ain't gonna lie he roasted that he roasted barbecue and he fried it so other than that i'm out this thing like comment subscribe notification notification bell on see you.